Hey everyone, did you know most houses are built with conventional designs and are constructed using common materials? But the houses in today's video are way outside the box with weird designs and construction methods. So today we're going to be taking a look at 15 of the most futuristic houses that look totally amazing. Alright, let's begin. Number 15. Duplicasa, Germany. One look at the futuristic design of the iconic Duplicasa home and you can see why it made this list. Called an architectural masterpiece, the house was designed by J. Mayer H. Architects and it's located in Germany near the town of Marbach. The geometry of the house comes from the footprint of a previous house on the location, but the house we see today was completed in 2008 and with 5 bedrooms, 8 bathrooms and more than 12,000 square feet of living space, Dupla Casa isn't just futuristic, it's mansion sized. The home is revered as a demonstration of how modern architecture can adapt to its environment and benefit from the beauty of surrounding nature. Number 14. High Desert House, Californian Desert this high desert house sits on the edge of Joshua Tree National Park and alien-esque is probably the best words to describe this unusual and amazing futuristic home. High Desert House is comprised of 26 freestanding concrete columns, all of which contribute to the home's otherworldly appearance. The idea for the home came from when the owners, artists slash Jay and Bev Doolittle, wrote San Diego architect Kendrick Banks Kellogg a letter. The letter stated that they had purchased an unconventional building site in the California desert. Kellogg wanted to visit this 10-acre plot of land and was instantly intrigued. From there, he set out to build what has become one of the most striking organic modern residences to date. Each of the home's columns is embedded seven feet into the bedrock to ensure stability. And the entire house was built from natural materials and the house appears to blend in seamlessly with its surroundings. One of the most striking features is the way that the columns fan out at the top to create a canopy-like roof. It took Kellogg five years to build the 5,000 square foot home and High Desert House was completed in 1993. Since its completion, High Desert House has been widely photographed. Number 13. Qum House, Egypt The Qum House in Egypt features a futuristic one-of-a-kind design. The fins of the home are made from reclaimed wood and the design comes from architect Karim Rashid. The Qum House is a concept house that was part of the Le Marche exhibition in Cairo, Egypt in December of 2010. Now, like many homes from the future, the Qum House is designed with the environment in mind. It was created to have a minimal impact on wherever the home would be built, if it were to become a residence. The house includes solar panels that heat water, low-voltage LED lighting, raised radiant flooring, and energy-efficient appliances, and the home is capable of reusing grey water too. The house also features a central skylight that not only gives the house a lot of natural light and warmth, but it also collects rainwater. This collected rainwater is then filtered by a plunge pool, and as eco-friendly homes become more and more popular, perhaps more architects will flex their creative muscles when designing eco-friendly homes, just like Rashid has done with the Kum House. Number 12. Capitol Hill Residence, Russia Vladislav Doronin had a dream. He wanted to work with famed architect Zaha Hadid. But when it came to working with her on massive projects, it was no dice for Doronin, so instead he commissioned her to build him a dream house. Hadid's visions for the home were spot on, a sanctuary above the treetops, a perfect entertaining space, and something unlike any other residence on the planet. The house has all the features you'd expect of a multi-million dollar home. A massive family room, an indoor pool, a library, various bedrooms, etc. But the house also boasts features that you wouldn't expect from a brilliant, renowned architect. A futuristic spaceship-like design with sloping windows and a unique top half of the house that stands out tall above the rest of the house. The Capitol Hill residence was built by renowned British architect Zaha Hadid and is the only private residence that Hadid ever built. So, as such, the house is also known as the Zaha Hadid House. The Capitol Hill residence is located in Barvika, a town that's west of Moscow in Russia. It's got about 2,600 square meters of living space and cost an estimated $140 million to build. This residence continues to be one of the most interesting, most luxurious, and most futuristic houses on the planet. Number 11. Willow House, Singapore Perhaps as we move into the future, we will move towards creating a deeper connection with nature. And instead of building concrete jungles and living in cement pads, we'll build homes that blend harmoniously with the environment. 
Okay, probably not. Skyscrapers seem like they're here to stay, but it's nice to dream about a world where we're interconnected with nature. Enter the Willow House. The Willow House is a futuristic home that speaks to those who want to incorporate the beauty of nature into their actual homes. It's located in Singapore, and it's been designed by Gu's Architects. It is a gorgeous, greenery-laden design, so much so that it almost looks more like a park than a home. The Willow House has an open-style floor plan, and the home doesn't barricade the greenery out, as most homes do, but rather it welcomes it in. The home is surrounded by a swimming pool and other various shallow ponds. Also called a contemporary tropical courtyard house, the Willow House conjures up feelings of serenity and tranquility. The architects wanted the house to have a soul, and by allowing nature to flourish both outside and inside the house, the Willow House is not your typical home. The designers were quoted as saying, We have tried to draw nature in as much as we can in the relatively dense urban environment of Singapore. Yeah, I'd say they succeeded on that front. Number 10. The Tresarca House, Nevada You likely know Nevada for the glitz and glam of the Las Vegas Strip. Vegas is world-renowned for its entertainment, as people flock to the Strip to try their luck at the tables, to hit up the clubs, to lounge by the pools, or to see a highly acclaimed show. But beyond the Strip and its copious amounts of air conditioning, there's another side to Nevada. The Mojave Desert is one of the harshest climates in the world, and as such, living there is not everyone's cup of tea. The Tresarca residence, though, in Nevada forces us to see the desert from a different angle. The house was designed to work with the environment and to belong to it, rather than work against it. As such, the Tresarca house is very forward-thinking. It was designed by the Assemblage Studio in response to the challenges that the Mojave Desert and Las Vegas can raise. They incorporated natural elements into the home, like river stone, granite, and marble that speaks to the natural look of the nearby Red Rock Canyon. In complete contrast to the towering strip with its millions of lights and modernity, the Tresarca House speaks to a different side of Nevada, the rural, natural beauty of desert. Plus, come on, it's really cool looking. Number 9. The Razor Residence, La Jolla The Razor Residence, or the Razor House, is located in stunning La Jolla, California. The house was built in 2007 and features 10,000 square feet of main house. Because the house is right on the coastline of the Pacific Ocean, the designers wanted a little separation between the house and the majestic views of the blue water. So the house is walled in by sheets of glass, making the house transparent. The Razor House has glass-walled walkways and floating staircases, all of which add to the feeling of being suspended in the air. The house has four bedrooms, four baths, and two half baths. Every single bedroom and living area is outfitted with floor-to-ceiling walls of glass. In fact, there's so much glass that it's hard to distinguish between the outside and the inside. I guess so long as the glass is clean. Residents of the Razor House can while away the days swimming in the black-tiled heated swimming pool, lounging on the rooftop spa, or just kicking back and admiring the views. Number 8. H3, Greece Located in Athens, Greece, the H3 house was inspired by yachts and designed by 314 Architect Studio. The house features two floors, and the main part of the house is supported by pillars and hovers over the swimming pool, so it mimics the feel of a yacht. The pool actually passes right below the main living quarters, so the owners are never far from water. In fact, the water is one of the futuristic features of this house, since the water that surrounds the house is used to cool the house in the summer, and in the winter, the sun warms the water up to help warm the house. The rooftop patio offers a green space for the owners to take in the views, and the house offers a bioclimatic design. H3's got about 10,000 square feet of living space, and it sits on a site that's approximately 75,000 square feet. H3 has a distinctive, contemporary aesthetic, with clean lines and a minimalist approach. The home was completed in 2013 and cost roughly $4.3 million to build, which is actually comparable to the price of a yacht. But at least this house doesn't come with moorage fees. Number 7. The Heliotrope Home the Heliotrope home made headlines upon its completion, as it was hailed as the first house in the world to generate more power than it uses. This home's energy is completely renewable, CO2 neutral, and emissions free. To maximize solar energy, the home actually rotates so it can make the most of the sun's heat and light. The home is outfitted with dual-axis solar PV tracking panels, combined heat and power unit, and a geothermal heat exchanger. Everything in this home is built with reusable energy in mind. Even the balcony railings are solar thermal. 
The Heliotrope Home has a gray water cleaning system and a natural system for waste, so nothing is really wasted in this amazing house. The home was designed by German architect Rolf Ditsch, and there's actually three Heliotrope buildings. Two are exhibition buildings in Offenburg and Hippelstein, while the third is the architect's home in Freiburg. And while the design of the home is interesting, to say the least, the real appeal of this house is the fact that it's able to capture up to six times its energy usage, depending on what time of year it is. The Heliotrope home is perhaps a nod to future housing as we look for ways to reduce our carbon footprint and incorporate greener, cleaner methods into housing. The Heliotrope home is highly innovative, and as such, it's won a bunch of awards. Some of the more notable ones are the 2002 European Solar Prize, the 2005 Wuppertal Energy and Environment Prize, the 2008 German Sustainability Award, and the 2003 Global Energy Award. Pretty cool. Number six, Zero House. If you want a futuristic house, but you don't want to wait, then the Zero House might be for you. The Zero House is a compact, prefabricated house that can easily be shipped and quickly assembled. This odd-looking house has all the features you need from a home. It's got a full kitchen, a bath, a living room, etc. But here's the kicker. The Zero House does not require any external connections. That's right, this futuristic home generates its own power, processes its own waste, collects and stores rainwater, and requires very minimal maintenance. As such, the applications for the Zero House extend beyond just residential housing. How about an ecotourism resort? Sure, it could be used for that too. Office or living modules for remote workers, like construction or mining employees. Yep, Zero House would work for that too. The house can be placed in pretty much any environment, including ones that are remote or ecologically sensitive. The website says, Zero House, anywhere in the world. And given the versatility of the home, that's a pretty legit claim. Popular Mechanics has given the Zero House a thumbs up too, stating that it's best for people who wish the Jetsons were real. Yeah, that's probably a lot of people. The Jetsons were pretty cool. So who knows, perhaps the Zero House will become the standard for off-grid living in the future. Number five, Shell House, Japan. The shell house you are seeing here is an example of a futuristic design that aims to integrate human habitats with nature. Japanese architects are no strangers to unusual designs that try to work with nature rather than against it, and this shell house is no exception. Found deep in the woods in Nagano, Japan, the shell house stands out against the green, lush forest with its stark white concrete. It offers an unusual seashell-shaped design with two distinct ovals, curvy and elliptical. The shell house is a far cry from a standard cabin in the woods. The shell house was designed by Kotara Ide of Art Technic Architects, and it's in a harsh climate with very high humidity. So one of the most amazing features about this home is its ability to resist that high humidity. The house was built five feet off the ground, which protects it from the moist soil. It also offers up the perfect space to install a custom-made heating system. Because the house is made of reinforced concrete, and because it's off the ground, this house won't face the decay and rot problems that other, more traditional houses in the region face. The interior also offers a stunning space with curved walls and an open concept. So yeah, it's no surprise that the architecture of the future is focused on sustainable living. We need to find ways to collaborate with nature. And as our population continues to grow, we've got to also find ways to build sustainable housing in regions where we couldn't before. The Shell House is an amazing example of this. It overcomes the challenges posed by the climate it's in, moist and cold, while still attempting to blend in with nature. Number four, Treeness House. Looking to the future, many architects are trying to find ways to bridge the gap between human needs and nature. The Tokyo-based architecture office of Hakahisa Hirata has found a way to do this with their Treeness House designs. This futuristic residential complex is located in Toshimoku, Tokyo, Japan, and the unique design differs quite substantially from the ordinary stacked architecture of typical residential buildings. The building's got an organic layering system which makes room for exterior spaces not normally seen on residential buildings. The result is a more three-dimensional space, and it's been likened to the way that a tree takes up space in the air. The design was inspired by the formation of a tree, and like a tree, there's a central trunk that supports other parts of the building which branch off, hence the name Treeness House. The living areas have closed spaces like bedrooms, but outside the living areas are terraces and open indoor spaces that have been enclosed in glass. This creates sort of an ambiguous interior slash exterior. 
Greeneries planted in assorted places, and the greenery wraps itself around those spaces, creating a space that's very organic. The building is a multi-use building. The ground floor has parking and an office at the front. There's a gallery at the rear, and both stairs and an elevator connect the base to the upper floors, which feature a pair of standalone apartments, plus another space for an additional family, like grandparents. The main residence is across several levels at the top of the building, and according to the architect, the goal was to create a futuristic design and architecture that awakens human-animal instincts, in which the inside and the outside are reversed multiple times. Well, I don't know about all that, but I do know that the Trinus house is pretty cool to look at. Number 3. H2 Ohm Underwater where will we live when we run out of land? Some climates are pretty harsh and not really conducive to the idea of living your best life. Just because we can make a futuristic home that can withstand the frigid cold of Antarctica doesn't mean anyone will really want to live there. The same goes with the desert. Desert living is not for everyone. And while the potential of other planets is always looming on the horizon, there's still one place left on Earth that really hasn't been explored when it comes to regions for new housing projects. That, my friends, is under the sea. Welcome to the H2 Ohm, a fully functioning home with a pretty futuristic zip code. H2 Ohm was designed by US submarine structures, and this submerged structure doesn't just offer a view unlike any other in the world, it also offers the epitome of luxury. The house is 59 feet below the surface and is accessed by a private pier and an elevator. The website claims that this is ideal for lagoons, shallow seas, and lakes, so it looks like this prefabricated aquatic pad can be placed in quite a few different bodies of water. The house itself is 3,600 square feet, because why not? There's a lot of unused space in our waters of the world. So, it's two stories high, it's got two bedrooms, two bathrooms, a lounge, a master bedroom with an ensuite, a kitchen, a bar, a wine cellar, a library, and an entertainment area. Basically, it would be like living in an aquarium with a constantly changing view of the aquatic life. The lower floors feature ceiling-to-wall acrylic panels for optimal fish viewing, but if there aren't enough fish around to fit your fancy, then you can attract some with the home's automatic feeding devices. And the landscape can be altered by planting coral beds just outside the home to attract more marine life and aquatic animals. Apparently, real estate under the sea doesn't come cheap, though. Sources say that the H2 Ohm comes with a price tag of $12 million, give or take a few hundred thousand. Is this wet and wild, wonderful abode the wave of future housing? Only time will tell. Number 2. Monolithic Dome Homes we tend to build out homes based on squares and rectangles, but many futuristic designs feature curves. And when it comes to curvy futuristic houses, monolithic dome homes do it best. Monolithic dome homes are not one-size-fits-all type homes, as the company boasts that their homes can be everything you need and everything you want in the home of your dreams. Well, these dome homes can be built virtually anywhere and can be multi-storied, earth-bermed, above ground, or even entirely underground. The inside of the dome can be partitioned to create as many rooms as the owner wants. Plus, the owners can choose to have several interconnecting domes, so the possibilities are pretty much endless. According to the website, you can put pretty much anything you want inside these domes, including an indoor swimming pool, an exercise room, a separate apartment, or even a theater. The domes are energy efficient, durable, and virtually maintenance-free. The domes conserve space and electricity, and because they are domes, they use less materials to enclose them. They're also built with solar thermal systems in mind, so these cute little domes are really pretty green. Furthermore, all the domes are insulated with polyurethane foam, so all those energy-losing, heat and air conditioning, wasting nasty nooks and crannies in a regular home are easily filled in a dome home. But the really futuristic part of these dome homes is that they are disaster-proof. The company claims that their dome homes can survive most natural and man-made disasters. Floods, fires, earthquakes, hurricanes, tornadoes, you name it. Because of the dome's construction, materials, and shape, these domes might still be standing long after the neighbors' homes have fallen. In fact, the website claims that they have a lifespan that's measured in centuries, not just years. So even the big bad wolf with all his huffing and puffing cannot blow this thing down. But wait, there's more. They don't have roofs, so no need for a roof replacement here. They aren't built from wood, so no rot or termite problems, although various materials can be chosen to cover the dome's air-form outer skin. Basically, these dome homes are superstructures. 
No climate is too hot or too cold, no construction site too obscure or challenging. So if you want a home that will stand the test of time and then some, with little maintenance and less carbon footprint, then monolithic domes might be a good fit for you. Number 1. Mars Case Prototype the Mars Case prototype is about as futuristic as you can get, since the project imagines what it would be like if we were forced to live on Mars. The prototype was designed by Open Architecture in collaboration with the Chinese electronics company Xiaomi. The prototype was first revealed to the public on September 26, 2018, outside the Bird's Nest Stadium in Beijing. The prototype itself might lack the luxury and grandeur that so many other futuristic homes boast, but that's not the point. The Mars Case prototype is meant to force us to question the direction of our living habits, as well as explore the potential urban environments of the future. In short, the Mars Case prototype forces us to ask the questions, what are our essential needs? This prototype is pretty prolific, challenging every convention we have when it comes to what we need from our homes. What can we no longer rely on natural resources? What if we're forced to do without so much of the excessive consumption that we take for granted? Well, it's marketed as the ideal home of the future. The Mars Case prototype makes us rethink what we really need versus what we think we need. The home is a technological marvel, able to harness and recycle heat, the exhaust, the condensation, and any other byproduct generated by every electronic device inside of it. The house feeds energy, air, and water back into an integrated ecosystem, completely minimizing our consumption of resources. Furthermore, the entire home or module is lightweight, and the inflatable living spaces can simply be folded, packed up, and stored for easy transportation. So it's not just a home that redefines the notion of a home, it's also portable. Zero waste, self-circulating energy, easy transport, the Mars Case prototype isn't just a futuristic home, it's a home that gives us a look into a potential future, one where we've used up all our resources and have no choice but to rethink what is essential. Or a future where we're literally living on Mars in pods relying on our own recycled resources. This is minimalism on steroids and takes that concept of simplified living to a whole new level. But at the same time, there's something amazing about the fact that we've actually built a functioning prototype of a potential home on Mars. It's incredible, really, which is why the Mars Case prototype has built its way into the number one spot on this list of top 15 futuristic homes that are totally amazing. I'll see you tomorrow. Watch our future playlist for more top 15 videos about the future. Sit back, relax, and binge watch all of our best future-related videos.